Hi, welcome back. My name is Simon Curry, and welcome back to the Newbie Sax School. I'm going to teach you the notes on how to play Candy Dolphers. Lily was here. This was a top 20 hit back in the 80s. Now, I'm going to teach you the notes now uh, that go with it. The whole of this tune is based on, for us altos, uh, of a C-sharp pentatonic or C-sharp blues. I will go through those notes in a minute, uh, but I'll teach you the notes to the tune straight away. Now, it's a, a call and response tune. So the guitar plays the theme, and then you copy the theme. And what Candy has done is she's done some of the theme uh, and, but also she's done a lot of uh, pentatonic and blues phrases in there, which I will take you through. First uh, entry is the guitar. The guitar goes. And so the sax goes, starts on the G sharp. I'll play it for you first. So that's uh, a G sharp uh, with a thumb on, up, upper octave to an E, so that's three and two, and then you've got your F sharp, middle fingering, uh, and then a C sharp, no fingers. And to make it sound really cool, the first note being a G sharp, you go to a G natural first. So you go, so that's your first phrase. So the next phrase comes in, the guitar does and then Candy comes in with a, an out and out blues phrase. Um, so it's a G sharp, high G sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, and then two F sharps. And then you've got an E to a C sharp, C sharp, no fingers, and then down the octave to a G natural. Then you've got an F sharp, E, and you've got a C sharp, but the C sharp's quite quiet on the original. Now the C sharp is one, two, three, four, five, six, and the little finger on the C key there, and you go over to this side, and you've got your C sharp there. So you've got a little pad of four keys, and it's the outside one, and it sounds. So the whole phrase sounds. Last time really slowly. Okay, and then the guitar, next phrase comes in with the low part. And she does it again, so this is the first phrase I've showed you. So your G to G sharp, to E, F sharp, C sharp. Okay, then the guitar comes in with the, the next phrase. And she does another blues phrase. And I'll tell you the notes. So you've got your B. To make that sound really funky and cool, you do your side A sharp. So it's one, two there, and that one there, and your thumb on. And you go, and open your and go to the B, so A sharp to B slowly. Now the next phrase you've got is a G natural, an F sharp, and then an E to C sharp. And the C sharp's no thumb, no, no octave key. And it sounds... So the first two are slurred, and then second two are tongued. Okay, the next part of that phrase is two F sharps, and then an E to the C sharp. Your E's three and two with your thumb on, and C sharp, no fingers. And then B, one finger, no thumb. I do it slowly.
And that brings us to our next phrase, okay, which is the guitar going. And what Candy does is mirrors that phrase. So she would do a C sharp. And the first C sharp that she does, she does a C to C sharp to make it sound cool. There's no thumb on it. Have a listen. And the next an E. E. Then a B. And then a C to C sharp. Like that. And then the E. So C sharp, E, B, C sharp, E. Okay, then the guitar comes in. And then she does another blues phrase. G to G sharp. With the thumb on. Then a B. C sharp. All with your thumb on. And then a G natural, F sharp, E and C sharp. All tongued. G, F sharp, E, C sharp. So you've got... And you've got your F sharp, E, C sharp, C sharp. And those two C sharps, she's making it sound really cool and uh, sexy and bluesy with your C to C sharp. B, G sharp, C sharp. And then you've got your G natural, F sharp, E down the octave. Bottom C sharp, one, two, three, four, five, six, and that one there. So the whole lot sounds like this. So I'll do it fast first. Do it slowly now. Okay, brings us to our next phrase. So the guitar goes. Now, I'm going to show you two versions of this. I'll show you the high version, which is what Candy does. So you've got your top uh, G sharp. So that's your thumb on, one, two, three, and your little finger. So it's G to G sharp. Like that. And then you've got your top E, which is your, your D key, your E flat key. And over on this side here, you've got your E key there. And those three with the thumb on. Then you take your E key off. And then open C sharp. And then G sharp. F sharp. E. F sharp. E. C sharp. And it sounds like this really slowly. Faster. Really slowly now. Right, well that's the, the hard high phrase. I'm going to tell, show you an alternate easy way of doing it, which is down the octave. G, G to G sharp. E, E. And D sharp. One, two, three, four, five, six, with a little finger on there. G sharp, no finger. G sharp. F sharp, E. F sharp. So down the octave, it sounds. That's the easier version. Uh, so you've got your high version and you've got your low version. On the PDFs you can download on my website, you've got both versions. You've got the easy version and the, uh, the full version. So next we've got our guitar part coming in. Okay, and then I've got two versions for you. So the hard version is Candy does a top E. So it's thumb on, uh, your high D, your high E flat, and there you go to high E. 
and then D sharp. Those those two take that one off there. G sharp, G sharp, and then G natural, F sharp, E, F sharp, and then G natural, G natural, F sharp, E, C sharp, and then C sharp, no foul. at the end and it sounds that's the high version so now the easy version you take the whole lot down the octave so you've got your middle E so it's one two three four five D sharp, so six fingers with a little finger on. All these have got your thumb on the octave key. And then you've got now you've got your C sharp. And then you've got your G sharp. So it's. Then you've got your G, F sharp, E, F sharp. And then I've taken this up, back up the octave to how it is originally. Uh, high G. I, G, F sharp, E, C sharp, no fingers, and you've got C sharp. So the whole lot of that phrase goes. Do it slowly. So that's all that she does in the tune. Now she goes into improvisation. And uh, the improvisation is based on the blues and the blues scale. And in my next tutorial, if you'd like to go to the website uh, and have a look at the um, website for the licks and blues uh, phrases that she uses, I've got a breakdown, videos, PDFs. Uh, the PDFs are free for you to download. Uh, and I also have got my members area which I'm charging uh, at the moment £4.99 a month. So that's a pound a week uh, to access over 400 videos, uh, tips and tricks. And you've also got access to group uh, tuition, uh, group jam sessions, uh, and a whole lot of uh, fun with lots and lots of nice people that are regularly contributing and chatting and meeting and playing together. Um, so that's it. Uh, I hopefully I'll see you in the next tutorial. Thank you very much.